Our main goal for our uh, off-season athletic performance program is to work with the athlete, forming a relationship so they're becoming a better athlete and thus consequently becoming a better baseball player. A very important goal for the off-season is to develop mental toughness, mental discipline. The whole idea is staying with that model of being comfortable while being uncomfortable. It's taking them in there and putting them, say, with the hitter doing some type of uh, an Olympic lift movement. So we're focused on a power clean one day. Well now, have the discipline to make sure you're doing, you're performing, you're executing the lift right. What you do in the weight room is what you're going to do out on the baseball field. The program that Lance has developed, right now the mental toughness part is probably the toughest because they're having to do a lot of things that they haven't done before. My definition of mental toughness is as follows. Doing something that you hate to do and being motivated and challenged to master it. He creates a lot of things that they haven't done before and they're finding out that they can do it. What we really ask the guys to do for us is to make the commitment to each other to say look to your left look to your right feed off of each other's energy to produce the ultimate team goal of winning conference getting to the regionals getting to the super regionals getting to omaha and playing in the college world series so if again when i've asked to say look to your left look to your right there's the energy that we all have and they've done a wonderful job of feeding off of that, the energy that they've produced, the intensity that they've brought. These guys in the weight room, there's a huge difference from last year. Last year, everyone was fired up just because it's the off season, the season's around the corner. But this year, there's a sense of urgency. Everybody's working hard and pounding out extra reps. Just how hard people are fighting and scratching and clawing in the weight room to get back where we need to be. This, sense, this energy is just outstanding. You can just tell we have a bitter taste in our mouth from the past two seasons. and. Uh, I mean, we want to win, and that's what we're here to do, and we're working hard mentally, physically, and in every aspect of our game to become a better team as a, as a complete whole. I think if you just look at the past players who've been here, guys like Drew Stubbs and Brandon Workman, and you know, those guys who are in the big leagues right now, you've, you, they come back in the offseason, you watch what they do, and it's the same, pretty much the same program what we're doing right now, and that gives you confidence to know the big league guys doing that, that's, that's why I need to do at that next level. One player's lost 17 pounds, another one's lost 22 pounds. They put on mu lean muscle in, in the core development program that he has for them. Already they've reduced their running times in the 60 yard dash. They're becoming world class athletes and that's what they need to be to be a major leaguer, mentally and physically. Well, we've got the resources here like between all the coaches and Lance and Ford and Cole in the weight room. They build your confidence by making you physically stronger, mentally stronger, and being there to support you and get on your butt when they need to. They're making us do things that are not only hard but can take a toll physically on your body, but mentally as well. You've got to get past that barrier and be mentally tough through all aspects of the game. It's not just the physical aspect of the game because at this level everybody's pretty good, and but the great teams are the ones that can get through it mentally and fight through the hard times and that's what what we've been working on as a team. You know, having a huge group in the weight room really makes it a lot more competitive. You got music blaring, guys are throwing up heavier weight than they did last year. When you're in the weight room and you have eight reps and you gotta go 10 or 12, you're gonna have guys pushing you, screaming, you know, let's go, like you got it. It's gonna be the same thing in the game. You know, bottom of the ninth, two outs, run on a third, it's do or die situation. Your whole team's gonna be backing you up. 